Hi, my name is David Caulfield. I'm the Sales and Marketing Director of BA Components, based in two factories, one in Cookstown in Northern Ireland and the other in Doncaster in Yorkshire, both in the United Kingdom. I'd like to take you on a brief walk through the production processes that go into making both our vinyl wrapped and our acrylic face doors. BA Components are the market leaders in the United Kingdom in this field and many of the 250 employees, both from Cookstown and from Doncaster, in our two state-of-the-art factories, have had a hand in making the doors that will make the dreams come true of many people here to have that European kitchen that they've always wanted at a price they can't afford. Join me on the journey. The starting point is the 18mm E0 MDF we use for the doors. We use this rather than 16mm particle board, widely used in doors on offer in many stores in your region today. The board has all been sourced from renewable and environmentally sustainable sources because BA Components are members of the FSC, that's the Forest Stewardship Council. This board is stored under closely regulated conditions, both temperature and humidity controlled, and they are constant for 24 hours a day, every day of the year. This ensures that the quality of the products produced are not compromised in any way. The next process is sawing. The board is cut to the door size on one of two Selco saws in the factory. These saws are carefully calibrated and checked to ensure cleanness of cut and accuracy of measurement. The next process is routering to put both a radius on the edge and create any panels or patterns within the door design. Hinge holes are added and any other drilling that is needed on the reverse of the door are added at the drills. All doors pass through a sophisticated belt sander. There are five different sanding belts moving in different and opposite directions and this means that the doors are actually sanded to an almost glass-like finish. Doors are sorted by size and carefully stacked in preparation for having the edges spread. All four edges are spread with a two-pack adhesive two spray booths to ensure all four edges are spread twice. Doors are then fed onto one of five gluing and pressing lines we have in our factories. First of all, the fronts or face of the doors are sprayed with the same adhesive as was sprayed on the edges, this time by robotic spraying equipment designed to ensure even and constant spread of adhesive throughout the surface. The doors arrive at the press where the operatives ensure they are correctly aligned on the pin bed to allow the door to be slightly elevated while in the press. This allows the foil to be formed around the door, creating a complete seal. Heat is applied in the press and a membrane is forced around the foil and the door, forming into any route pattern and edge under both pressure and vacuum. This particular press in Doncaster is the largest of its kind in Europe. The full press of doors now need to be turned over ready for cutout into individual pieces. Here every door is cut out individually by hand before being given a final inspection. Each inspector stamps their own unique reference code in the hinge hole so we can throughout the life of this door have full traceability back to the batch, the press line and the individual who passed the door. The other type of door that you can see in the store today is an acrylic face door. The first procedure for the E0 board when an acrylic face door is being produced is the addition of a foil on the board's reverse. The foil is added in a cold lamination process on this machine, one of the most modern and efficient in Europe today. The foil is applied using PUR glue which is a very high heat and water resistance making it ideal for bathroom and kitchen environments. Pressure is applied by use of a series of rollers and after the foil has been allowed to cure the sheets are turned over and the acrylic sheet applied using exactly the same cold lamination process. The acrylic sheets are cut to door size on a CNC router where a sophisticated optimization program ensures the best possible use of each sheet. This is known as a nesting process and doors of different sizes can all be cut at the same time. Glass Effect 3D ABS edge banding is applied edge by edge to all four edges ensuring that the unit is completely sealed. 
We do this using one of today's most sophisticated edging machines. PUR glue is applied to the edges and the high precision trimming, polishing and buffing units along the length of the machine leaves a perfect edge time after time. All doors, whether vinyl wrapped or acrylic faced, are individually boxed and sealed. Two operatives are involved in the process, one giving the doors a further and final inspection prior to sealing the box. The doors are then stacked by size, colour and range of pallets, ready for transportation. The doors are now ready for the journey to their final destination. They are carefully packed on lorries and transported to the docks for onward shipment to their destination. Great skill, care and attention to detail have been invested by the staff at BA because we really want that kitchen to be something that's appreciated and enjoyed for years to come.